sweaty, but we basically just did a not so quick little deep clean of the whole downstairs. Me and Tanya just put on our music and we didn't expect to clean so much, but like I said, we put on our music and we just basically kept on cleaning everything. We did all the dishes, wiped down all the counters, the cabinets, everything. Like the kitchen looks immaculate right now. There's still, I mean, we didn't do like 100% deep clean, but it's pretty damn near. We also cleaned the table, wiped down the table, um, windows clean, floors clean and swept and all that and started literally like wiping down all the doors and everything and yeah we we put on our music we basically went to town <laughs> but it's uh, about 1 30 right now Michael's gonna be getting out of school soon so we're gonna go get ready yeah. all right we just picked up Michael say hi Michael and uh, right now, we're hungry. We haven't eaten since breakfast. And, and we've, we've been, been cleaning yeah, all day. Yeah, we've been cleaning. Ooh. We worked up an appetite. So we're going to eat some Chipotle right now. Chipotle. And then after, are we still going to the store? Yes, we have. Okay, we're going to the store apparently. And then after, <laughs> <laughs> I've been wanting to make some ribs. I just bought some ribs uh, a couple of days ago. And dinner. it's like cloudy and rainy outside. I don't feel like cleaning the grill, so I think I'm going to make them in the oven. Yeah. So, yeah. We're going to go eat right now. We're uh, eating outside today. We usually eat outside, but the weather feels really good. So we're gonna eat outside. There's Joseph not listening. And then Luke fell asleep. He's working out. <laughs> I'm gonna eat your quesadilla. I'm gonna eat it. Let me see, take, take a big, big boy bite. bite. Over here, over here. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Good job. Alright, so we uh, picked up Michael from school. We went to go eat Chipotle. And we were supposed to go to the store, but it just started raining like as we were eating outside. So we are just like, nah, let's just go home. So I'm going to start getting dinner ready. It's about 5.30. And I'm making some ribs in the oven. It's a... a just a quick little uh, recipe I found on YouTube. Um, I think I bake it for like three, at 350 degrees for like two hours or three hours, something like that. But yeah, I'll just show you guys like a quick little rundown of what I do. Right, so you already know if you're Hispanic what the first step is. I gotta clear out the oven. Are you baked? Are you baked? Soil, sweaty but I just finished cleaning up everything the ribs are baking it's about seven o'clock right now and there's still like an hour left and then I'm gonna sauce them up and then put them back in there for like another 10 minutes so I'll get that sauce all car uh, caramelized oh. all right 
I'm finally done. Ribs are in the oven. They've been baking. There's like a less than an hour left. Put the sheets to wash. Now I'm going to chill and watch TV. Yeah, well, it's funny. Tiny's been chilling here for like ever, for like an hour. An watching hour? Since, dude, I put the ribs for two hours and there's less than an hour there. I'm just saying, look, I'm just saying, it's funny. Tanya's been chilling here on her phone, not watching TV, nothing. As soon as I sit down, grab the remote, she's like, oh, what are we watching? And then I want to watch something, and she's like, I don't want to watch that. I'm like, you could have been watching something Mommy. this whole time. <laughs> I just mean, we should be watching something together. Yeah, you could have put something on. Why? I was Why? waiting for you. Uh -huh. Alright, so they've been cooking for almost two hours now, and I'm going to check them, probably pull them out and start saucing them up, and then cook them for like another ten minutes or so. Woo-wee! Meatloaf? Woo-wee! Alright, so I think Michael mentioned this earlier when he was helping me, but I used the... Famous Dave's barbecue sauce. I like the, I think it's called Devil Spit, and it's like really hot but really good. But everybody else thinks it's a little too hot, so I like to get the, this one's the rich and sassy. It's not as hot, but it still tastes pretty good. Okay. It was about to do something. All right, so I just put the sauce on the ribs and I put it back in there. And I'm gonna broil it for about 10 more minutes to get the, the sauce nice and caramelized. Alright, so I let them caramelize for about five minutes because it looked like it was getting a little too crispy for my liking, but it still looks it, it looks a little over, but it looks bomb though. So I just pulled them out. Tell me that don't look good. It looks a little burnt right here, but I don't really care. I really kind of like it. Looks good to me. Alright, so I just sauced them up. And I don't know, but to me they look pretty bomb. A little more crispy on this side, but still looks pretty good. How'd it come out? Terrible. What? <laughs> How dare you? She said with a mouthful of meat. <laughs> huh? How's my meat taste? Huh? Really good? Yeah. <laughs> Tearing it up. Just took the other one out too. About to sauce it up and then put it for a little longer. Alright, I didn't really want to brag, but these look so good, dude. They're... Ooh, look at this. Ugh. They look so good. And like I said, I got the recipe off of YouTube, super simple. Um, the guy used mustard, but he said he could use oil. I used oil, and then, as a, you know, you use it as a binder, so the uh, seasoning and the rub can stick to it really good. I used my own seasoning, and I think I showed it already, and then literally set the oven to 250 for, no, not 250, uh, 350 for two hours. I it was 375. Uh, oh, 375, sorry, 375 for um, two hours, took it out, and put some uh, sauce on it, put it back for like uh, five minutes to broil so it could get that nice caramelized sauce, and then took it out. And then once I took them out, put a little more sauce, and boom, they're done. Tanya said they're perfect. Michael, he's already on the second plate. The boys are super picky, but oh well, what can you do? Yeah, they're little, they don't really know what's good, but I'm about to tear it up. All right, so we just finished eating a couple minutes ago. I am so stuffed. That was so good. I can't recall the last time I made ribs that good. The only thing that was missing was a sweet tea, but oh well. Um, we, we cleaned up a little bit, you know, cleaned up the table, got all the dishes in the sink. We're gonna go put the kids to sleep and then come back down and finish cleaning, but I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. Um, just a nice little day in my life type vlog on one of my days off. If you guys enjoyed it, please hit like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Um, thanks for watching.